All right, we're joined by McCord Grice here on Wisconsin.golf uh, round of 70 today. Yes, sir. And a really solid score in these conditions. I guess for, let's start there. Um, how good was a 70 out here today with this setup? Yeah, it was pretty good. It definitely was a lot harder in the first two days. Uh, much more to maybe what you'd see at the Open compared to the last two days. Uh, it was super tough, but I'm super happy with the number I put up. What was the key today? Ball striking. I kept it in play all day for the most part. Driver was working, the irons were good, and I just made a couple putts that I didn't yesterday. You were one of many that had uh, issues with nine, but not not to the level other people did. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And on a day like today, you're almost happy to come away with a five. I, I am happy only because I, I actually, like, my ball landed probably within a foot of the hole. I hit a nine iron. I didn't think it would spin, and it spun all the way off the front. Wow. So it was a, it was playing like a par five from 100 and. <laughs> 30 yards so <laughs> <laughs> what uh, what's this been ex experience been like for you obviously first time stadium what, what, what how have you felt about uh, you know playing in this one yeah I mean for a first one it's kind of hard to beat right I mean it's just an unbelievable golf course this is my first summer in Wisconsin since joining the golf team at UW <laughs> um, and I mean I couldn't have asked for much more my caddy Eric's been awesome as well he's made the whole experience I mean it's been it's been awesome Eric Fritz is that his name yes yep, okay yep and how does he help you kind of maybe stay a little bit focused and, and maybe learning things about the course that you can't see from, you know, as your line shots? Yeah, are. he's awesome, especially on the greens. Uh, he definitely gets some subtle breaks that I would not see for my first couple times out here. And we've just had a good dialogue. And, um, yeah, I mean, every shot we're kind of going back and forth on numbers. Uh, it's been a really good pairing so far. McCord, you've had a wonderful summer so far. And, uh, you know, I have to figure that there's a lot of internal competition brewing on this Badger team that's producing a lot of great results from people. How would you characterize what you've done this summer and how much of that is kind of gearing up for the fall? Yeah, I mean, all of it's gearing up for the fall. I mean, you know, my goal, my life goal was to play for the Wisconsin golf team. And, you know, last year, I, Obviously, didn't get to, didn't, did not get to quite play as much as I wanted to, and uh, I put a lot of, lot of hard work in, especially over the winter. And you know, this summer we're starting to see the, the fruits of that labor. And um, I would just, yeah, I mean, we're a super competitive group. Everyone on the team pushes each other, um, and yeah, you're kind of seeing the results of that from everyone that's, that's dedicated a lot of time to, to the game. What's different about your game right now? What have you worked on the most, and where are you seeing the most results? Yeah, the most results have. One has probably just been the driving. I, especially in the winter, you know, we have a great indoor facility during, you know, when it's snowing, and I basically just put all that time to speed training and, while well, speed training and trying to shorten my golf swing. So, keeping things super consistent as well as just pretty much trying to just bomb the ball, trying to keep up with Ross <laughs> out <Yeah>. there. <laughs> <laughs> is he the big hitter? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to be coached then, right? Yes, yes. That's always the goal is to try to beat Ross. <laughs> <laughs> Now, I've also heard that you're probably one of the harder workers on the team. There may, because the facility is self-locking, you may or may not have been locked in or out. <laughs> yes. Is there any truth to that rumor? <laughs> that is true. Yes, I was I was locked. We, I was trying to warm up there before the Ray Fisher to try to use the range there, and my card didn't work. I, I couldn't get into the building to go warm up. So I ended up going down to, like, the, um, the regular practice area. So, yeah, that's pretty funny. What time of day was that? Oh, God, that would have been... Couple hours, like a couple hours ago, like before the tea time, mm. I, I couldn't even put in. I mean, yeah. I so don't know. it just wasn't the building wasn't open. No, uh, it was locked. It, it was, was locked. it was like it was like noonish, and oh, it, really? I, I wasn't I wasn't letting me in, even though it had let me in the day before. So I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they're doing the NCAA minimum requirement yeah, get, or some I, I or maximum so. requirement. Yeah, I guess so. you've, you, you've exhausted your your practice time. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. and. Uh, it, so you, you qualified at Riverside, right? Yes. And yep. you played really well. Yes. What were your expectations coming in here and, and now three rounds through? How do you feel about where you're at? Yeah, I mean, I feel pretty good. I honestly, I have no idea where I stand exactly. I just know, I, I just today, I just tried to put up the best score I could. Um, expectations, I mean, I played really well at the qualifier. Um, I mean, I've seen a lot of good golf this summer and in the spring. And I mean, just building building off the qualifier was huge. I didn't really have any expectations coming into Aaron Hill specifically. I played once before. I love it. I love the golf course. I think it suits up well for me with like a big ballpark. Um, I mean, I, I honestly just had no expectations. Sure. Kind of cliche, but no expectations. Just play my game, play against myself, and you know, see what happens. How are the Braves doing this year? The Braves are good. Are I'm good? very happy. We lost last night, but <laughs> hoping for uh, hoping for a win tonight. You know that the Braves.
Braves came from Milwaukee. I, I do know that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. you're you're kind of back back to the origins. I'm in I'm in friendly territory up here. I'd say. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well, McCoy, great job today. Keep it up tomorrow. Thank you.